Welcome to Rapid Fire Quiz number 5. These are the instructions and the syllabus of this Rapid Fire Quiz. I want you to pause this video for now and I want you to read the instructions and the syllabus of this Rapid Fire Quiz. So pause the video now. I hope you're done. Okay. All the very best for this quiz. Here comes the first question and your time starts now. Stop. The correct option is option A. A recurrence relation is a mathematical expression that describes how to solve a big problem by solving smaller sub problems. It is the true statement. Now let's move to question number two. And your time starts now. Stop. In this question, we have been told to find the recurrence relation of time complexity of this specific algorithm. In this algorithm, we have the base case and the recursive case. We can easily find the recurrence relation for this algorithm and that too of time complexity. If we are assuming Tn is the time required to solve this algorithm, that is sum of n, then t of n minus 1 must be the time required to solve sum of n minus 1. And here we are performing one addition operation. This will take constant amount of time. And the base case will also take constant amount of time. That is why option B is the correct option. Here we have Tn equal to Tn minus 1 plus 1. If n is greater than 1, otherwise if n is equal to 1, that is the base case, then we will get C which represents the constant. Here we have 1. 1 is also representing constant. That is the time required to perform the addition. Now let's move to question number 3. And your time starts now. Stop. The correct option is option B. The specific problem requires a bit of work, but I hope you got the correct answer. And I hope you got the correct answer by seeing the pattern while solving this problem using the substitution method. Now let's move to question number 4. And your time starts now. Stop. The correct option is option D. Why option D? We can observe in the base case we are not performing any multiplication. So clearly we must get 0. We are left with these two options that is option B and option D. In the option B we have m of n equal to m of n minus 1 plus n. This is representing the recursive case. Here we have plus of n and here we have plus of 1. Why plus n is not right? Here we are performing just one multiplication, not n multiplications. So clearly this option is the correct option. Now let's move to question number 5 and your time starts now. Stop. The correct option is option A. Clearly, we are performing one addition here. 
and we are performing no additions at all here. So this must be 0 and this must be 1. And here we are representing the number of additions by A of n for this algorithm. So clearly the number of additions required for some array ARR n minus 1 will be A of n minus 1. So clearly option A is the correct option. Now let's move to question number 6. And your time starts now. Stop. The correct option is option C. Clearly, in the base case, we are performing one comparison. We can observe we are comparing n with 1. And here also, we are performing one comparison. And we are representing the number of comparisons by C of n for this specific algorithm. For this max element ARR n minus 1, it will be C of n minus 1. So clearly option C is the correct option. Now let's move to question number 7 and your time starts now. Stop. The correct option is option A, order of n or big O of n. Now let's move to question number 8 and your time starts now. Stop. We already know how many moves are required to solve the problem of Towers of Hanoi if we have n disks. If we have n disks, then the formula to calculate the number of moves is 2 power n minus 1. So, if we apply the same formula here where n is equal to 4, we will get 2 power 4 which is equal to 16 and 16 minus 1 is 15 so clearly option B is the correct option. Now let's move to question number 9 and your time starts now. Stop. Here we have been asked to write the recurrence relation of time complexity of towers of Hanoi problem with n disks. The recurrence relation is Tn equal to 2 times Tn minus 1 plus 1. You already know the algorithm of towers of Hanoi. Now finding the time complexity for that algorithm and writing the recurrence relation is not that difficult. This is going to be the recursive part of the recurrence relation Tn equal to 2Tn minus 1 plus 1. Now let's move to question number 10 and your time starts now. Stop. The correct option is option C, that is big O of 2 power n. The algorithm takes exponential amount of time. The growth rate is exponential. So this is the answer to this problem. Now we are done with this quiz. Now I want you to post your score in the comment section. Thank you so much for taking this quiz. I'll see you in the next one.